Okay. So, uh, a little something different. Uh, a quick warning, I have played through not all of the game, but like maybe 50% of it. With the experience I have now, uh, I think I could at least uh, blast through the game so uh, I can finally catch up. Oh, hold on, wait. We've got some cutscenes. Oh, here it comes. Oh, I, I gotta like at least mention this. Come on, hurry up! The Queen's anniversary is gonna start without us, guys. But the cutscenes look so good yeah. in Xeno Tree. Holy! Like you mean it? It's so I don't know. It just slow down, guys. It's so different. Well, like different in a good way. True, um, compared in uh, Xeno One and Two. Yeah, saw them setting up yesterday. There were loads of them. It'll be worth it. Promise. Oh, I really gotta see this as well. Uh, so Tales of Arise also has like this anime art style, but Xeno Two or sorry, not sorry, Xeno Two, Xeno Three uh, does it does also also does the art, uh, anime art style, but it looks really really good, like as good as uh, uh, Tales of Arise. That, that's what I really like about this uh, art style, like uh, Xeno. Oh, hold on. It's a water though. All right. Uh, so in um, fuck, what was I saying? Oh yeah, right. Uh, Zeno, uh, Zeno one, our cell was like peak. Like, oh man, it can't get better than this. And then Zeno three came out, and like, oh, this looks really, really nice. Especially with the with the the coloring and all that stuff. Like, like their um their eyebrows. No, not really. Uh, I guess eyelashes or something like that. You can see like some color into there. And also, not gonna lie, I actually forgot about this part in in the playthrough. I'm like, man, I feel like this is something like uh, important. No. Uh, I haven't. They haven't really addressed this in the part that I'm in, uh, but you know, we'll, we'll we'll see what happens. Oh, by the way, um, most most of this video is gonna be just uh, us watching cutscenes. Uh, you know, but I'm I'm down. I'm down for this. Uh, the cutscenes are like, again. I can't trust it enough. It looks so good. Oh, dude. I, yeah. <laughs> Man. Okay. Not gonna lie. This is actually uh, the intro is getting me excited again. But I forgot how epic the intro is. Colossal martial nations locked in war. Kevez and Agnes. What is it they need to stay alive? Water? Food? Certainly. But what we need most is life itself. Taking each other's lives. With the taken flames becoming your own in turn. Hey yo, shout out to one Jimmy. The, the one whose essence is stolen. Leaves only a husk. Oh, by the way, I would just like to say, 
Does anyone get like Fire Emblem? Um, oh no, not, not three houses. It's the uh, uh, Birthright and Conquest. Anyone getting those vibes, or, or is it just me? Cause like, <laughs> okay, the the white side sound terrible. Uh, resembles a uh, a Birthright, and then like um, the dark side. Man, that sounds really really bad. <laughs> Uh, the other side uh, resembles a uh, conquest. Fighting in order to live and living to fight. That's the way of our world, Ionios. Cruel irony that it should mean eternity, because slowly but surely, oh, there's a gang he's now dying. Right. Even though we have yet to realize that fact. Dude, this is so cool. I like how they can like summon their weapons. Uh, it's, it's just like uh, I think Final Fantasy 15. No, uh, the one with Noctis. There's still more of them. Even so. Shut it! Stop flapping your gums and move! Yeah, we've got more incoming. Hey, well, this beast kind of kind of hits hard, eh? Oh yeah, right. Uh huh. Okay. Uh, so I'm gonna just skip through a bunch of the uh, uh, of the tutorial because I I have familiarized myself with the uh, with the combat so far. Uh, I stated earlier. But yeah. Man, I kind of wish they didn't remove the whole, um, the whole, uh, anime can- no, not anime- animation cancels, uh, when you're doing this. So, for those who don't know, in Xeno 2, uh, when you attack, you can actually cancel your recovery animation by just moving the, uh, the joystick a little bit. So you can just attack, and then move, and then attack again. Uh, but this, as you can see, you can't attack. And then, it, and then if I do this, if I try to uh, do the animation cancel as you would in Xeno 2, yeah, it just takes a while. So, or it takes a while to to attack. Way too soon. When back then it used to be just super instant. Uh, but man, you know, uh, but but you do, you, you do get used to it though. That's the thing. Uh, one grip that I do have with this game uh, is that the. Uh, the, the targets. There you go. So you can see how you can like target different characters, right? Or different enemies. It's just very. It's, so okay. Eventually we'll get like eight party members. For well, no, not really eight. I guess six. Uh, six party members. And it just gets way too hectic. And having this little marker is so hard to see. Okay. Uh, we'll, we'll get there when we get there. But for now, just just enjoy the simplicity of having three characters on screen. Oh yeah, and this guy. Yeah, uh, we don't talk about that guy. I'll keep up the attack. All right. Oh, nice. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. Now we're getting arts. Okay, okay. Holy, yeah. I remember playing a uh, Xenoblade, and I just did not vibe with the game at all. Oh, whoops. Uh, it was just the whole like just standing around and waiting for the cooldowns. It, it wasn't me. It wasn't for me. But but now it's I don't really mind the, uh, the auto attacking uh, because there's so much to do in this uh, in this game and, and also in, in the other uh, past two uh, Xenoblade games uh, I guess I was just too impatient because it was this early game but yeah uh, tr trust me that the gameplay gets way better although I'm not really sure if it's uh, if it's uh, uh, playthrough worthy uh, or I guess, no sorry not not playthrough worthy uh, playthrough friendly. Here we go, guys. Let's give him the usual, Noah. Noah, yes, we sir. Time to draw weapons. Power ring. Power ring. Right. All the way there. <laughs> okay, that's fine. Nice one, Wamba. Holy. Oh. Uh, All right. I will say this. Uh, uh, so, in any uh, JRPG, these guys are like my favorite, um, uh, a group of, um, party members. Like, it feels like they're not, like, like an actual team. Uh, you'll see what I mean, um, when we uh, get further into the game, but I, I just like the uh, dynamic. Then, ugh, oh, I missed. <laughs> it's fine, it's fine. Alright. Man, alright, I'm gonna just, uh, take a- Whoa! Dang. 
Yeah, I forgot how big the uh like this game feels big. There's a, there's a lot of stuff going on. And all right, that didn't work out how I planned it to be, but okay. Ah uh, yes, the flame claw. They outflanked us. Lance, the front line. That Trish's team. Uni, how are things with Kite? What about our backup? Looks like they're busy guarding the artillery. They're not going anywhere. Anyone's moving right now, it's us. You see what I mean with the uh, whole, like, uh, art style? They do it so well. Oh, and also the, um... If the front line breaks, we're all dead! The eyes. Uh, the position! Like... It's not like... It doesn't... It feels we alive, if, if that makes sense. Come like, on, the eyes... It. If you look very closely, it looks like... Yeah, yeah, like, right there. Like, it like moves a bit, right? It, it, I don't know, it, to me it just feels like very like, like, human. Rather than just have, like, okay, so, <laughs> the worst contender for that is Pokemon. Because holy dude, if you look at the uh, Pokemon Sword and Shield uh, Pro Tags, their, eye, their eyes are just like deadpan, like like a dead fish. It's just very so uh, unsettling. It's do or die, Noah. Although, I'll say it's mostly for the, um, for the 3D Pokemon games. I think that's like a 2D or 3DS. No, show them your talent. It's like, oh, I, I, the, the, the sprites. Uh, okay, yeah, 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 I get it, I get it, I get it, I get Okay, I get it, man. Uh, the sprites in, um, in Pokemon, it's like, it's so much more, um, has so much uh, personality to it. And th that's what I like about the, uh, the, the sprite generation of Pokemon. Oh, hold on, wait, Topple? Mm-hmm. Uh, sir, oh days. Oh, I don't have my uh, my thing ready. Yeah, yeah, I'm not gonna have my thing ready. Oh yes, yeah, sir. But this is the classic combination. Ugh. Okay, we'll wait. Hold on, use my thing. Okay, I guess it's just okay. No, no, I'm gonna I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna wait till uh, my thing recharges. We're gonna we're gonna do the full combo because we do a lot of damage. Hold on, back attack. And then okay, we're good. We're good. Okay. Yes, sir. Hold on, wait, wait for it, wait for it. We do this. All right, go for it. Uh huh. Uni, go for it. Uni, uni, uni. Ah, oh, come on, man. All right. <sighs> Hold on, we're gonna wait. We're, we are gonna get this combo if it's the last thing I'll do. Oh yeah, right. I can zoom in and out in uh, in Xenoblade. <laughs> In my earlier playthrough, I have no idea how to control that. So like for the most of the uh, most of the most of the level is just me like super zoomed in into like oh hold on wait into my character. Okay, ready? Okay, we're doing this one more time. Uni, uni, you better you better do it. Let's go! Alright, hold on, my turn. Is there 1307 damage? Alright, we're gonna win this match. Sorry, not match. Oh, fight. I forgot I'm not playing a fighting game. Nice. Okay, so it's gonna it's gonna go into like one of the quieter moments. So, sorry, sorry if I'm ruining a moment here. But another grab I had with uh with Zeno two was a pro tag. Cause holy dude, I like like I'm not a big fan of Rex. Oh shit, those <laughs> I forgot how brutal that was. Uh, I'm not a big fan of Rex's design. Uh, and I'm I'm a guy that likes to play a protagonist that looks cool. If you don't look cool, uh, the chances of me playing your game is gonna be uh, like slightly to none. Oh yeah, the, the surprise gets it gets kind of get, kind of it's kind of comedical. Hold on, wait for it. Buddy looks up, and yeah, holy dude, I am not a big fan of Rex's uh, booty shorts. It was it was not good luck. Uh, I'll say that much. But in this one, dude, the drip. So clean, so clean. It looks really, really good. And also in Xeno One, Z the Xeno One's drip was was pretty good as well. Although you can change your drip. Oh, that was another thing that, that bugged me. I'm Victory! Like, Screech! 
Uh, you can't change uh, Xeno 2's, uh, sorry, you can't change Rex's uh, costume, and that bugged me so much. Uh, not until you get like, well, even his like transformation thing that he gets, um, when he gets like, the futuristic suit. Man, it still has the booty shorts, and I go, man, you, you have an opportunity to change the character design, and you kept the booty shorts? <laughs> But it's fine. I, I enjoy the game for what it is. Although, not gonna lie, Zeke looks pretty sick. And Morag. Morag Mor 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 looks pretty cool. And Nia. Uh, second form Nia. It looks pretty sick. Basically, anyone who isn't Rex looks, looks pretty good. What? For those who know, we know. Ah, uh, yes, half of the Ying Yang symbol. Ugh, nani? It was an embryo all along. Crazy how they have their uh, their clothes um, in in the tube. Well, probably be a different game if uh, that wasn't the case. Every one of us is born looking like this, with clothes. As soldiers, that too. As weapons for slaying Agnians. Yes, all of us live only to fight. Stupid Noah! <laughs> nice one, Lance. Too early for that. Look, it's you they're after here. Just take out their attackers and we're golden. They're gonna get it handed to them. Flickering hoop. You're as slippery as Noah sometimes. Uni. Chick never shuts up. Kite. Range darts. Easy. Alright, the belly button choice was kinda it was kinda weird. Is anyone thinking the same thing too, or is it just me? Or at least the midriff. <laughs> School. Here comes the lad. Heroes never die. <laughs> you okay? Uni. Cheers for that. You're a lifesaver, Yorin. Your sparking dead weight. I pronounce it as Yorin. Uh, Yorin. If I say it fast enough, it's gonna sound like you're in, you know? Hey! Kinda don't wanna disrespect my mans like that. Kite! You keep firing and don't stop. Oh, what? Whatever you want. Huh? Go ballistic. Just draw their attention. Because what we're after here is that lame duck. You're in? But he's bottom of the class. Why bother? Thing is, the brat's still a decent healer. Get it? Ayo, attacking the MVP. Ayo, right. attack of it. Ayo, attacking the MVP like that. Me off. Oh, what the but fuck, my phone? Good as one. Oh, sorry. Yeah. yeah. Noah, can we flank him? 
probably. Not in their usual formation. Ah. Wait, what? <gasps> We're snuffed. Kai's just a decoy, so they're really after. Oh. The true MVP. Whoa, let's go, Lance. Or is it not Lance? Lance. I sometimes just pronounce it as uh, Lance. Lance. Uh, ah. Tough guy. But you can't hold out forever! Spark! Holy, I forgot how epic the uh the cutscenes are. Man, they do the fight scenes so well. I like it. Guns! You stay put! They wanna take you out the running! Oh pain! My shield! Yeah, but Nothing spot. <laughs> Why would you? Because we're Nakama. We're Nakama. I feel like this is foreshadowing, <laughs> or, or is that, or is that just me uh, just looking too deep in things? <laughs> Yo, what does he not have a midriff? Yo, what the heck? Why does everyone get to wear helmets but us? <laughs> Man, after a second playthrough, yeah. I'm starting to want, I'm starting to see things. Get Don't. off me! We're not gonna. Had to go and play the hero, didn't he? You really think you could have taken them? <sighs> I think Yorin did the right thing. If he hadn't used his powers back there, you'd have been first out of the running. Yeah, but still, didn't have to go get himself killed for it. Come on, he was trying to protect you. He lured in Garvel's gang. Gave us a chance to turn it around. Yo, whoever named their kid Garvel, yeah, you, you should really get your uh, your naming uh, privileges taken away from you. I'm sorry. Yeah, but just stop it. No more arguing. It's my fault. I should have just done a better job. Then I thought that. Won. Hey. <laughs> so much for getting to the final, huh? Sorry. I let us down on your big day. I'm so sorry. That's all right, bud. What big day? The birthday. What? Whose? Yours, dummy. It's your second term, right? Remember? Oh. A win would have been a nice surprise. Lance was pretty fired up too, weren't you? Cut it out! Hey! What? He'll apologize, right? Might do, might not. We each have a lifespan of ten years. We call them terms. Life begins with our first term and ends at the close of our tenth. And over the course of those ten years, we fight continually. Though in reality, there aren't that many who can hold their flame for the whole ten years. Most lose their lives on the battlefield before they reach year ten. But those who do survive to the end. I think how terms work is you start at ten years oh, old, and then the tenth term means you're twenty. So if you're on your second term, that means you're twelve. I, I think that's how it works. Morning, Yorn. Hey, Noah. Morning. Morning, uh, Lance. Hmm. Get a move.
move on. Quick, we're gonna miss the homecoming. First one they've ever had here, right? Yeah, isn't it awesome? Hey, look at that, it's Riku. <laughs> Alright, I can't be the only one, but who thinks that this guy is like evil as hell, you know? That guy's got the red and like the, the purple glowy shit. The man's even walks like a menace, dude. Ah. Whoa! Even the queens come out! So that's Her Majesty, huh? Wow! I've never seen her before! Oh. I wonder what's happening. Like, the implication is like uh, going back into the land. So, like, technically speaking, they're just killing them, no? So cool! I heard the stories, but this is just wild! That's gonna be me someday. Just you try and stop me. You guys, too. You're totally making it with me. Of course! Uh, hmm. And you, Noah, right? Huh? Sure. Yeah, you bet. Mr. Stark, I don't feel so good. Our lives came from the Queen, and we all lived for a chance to take part in the homecoming. The chance to return to the Queen's embrace. Carrying out ten years of service fighting. That was our whole world. Nobody ever thought to question it. I questioned it until you know, that day so like like exactly like, I'm my question still stands is the flute killing them or is the queen killing them and in that case couldn't you just like like play the flute and be like hey yo ever heard of Naruto Shippuden opening opening number one I forgot about that. Oh, look at the drip. Looks so good. Do you have to? Huh? You shouldn't be sending those guys off like that. What? Why not? Why are you like this, Noah? It's Agnes, our enemy. Well, yeah. They don't have an officer, though, to send them. Yeah, they all bit the dust thanks to us. 
So what? Look, there's no rule not to. Mm hmm Then what, you're just gonna keep going? Yes, sir. I don't get you, Noah. I know we're putting our lives on the line, but still. Yeah, yeah, we get it already. Friend or foe, someone has to lay them to rest. For that is my role as an officer. <laughs> Pretty good impression. Right. Uh, is my voice that deep? Shot at you. I wasn't trying to be anyone specific. Right. I've had about enough of all this depressing crap. Let's head back and hit the showers. I'm all gunked up with blood and sweat. Ah, oh, bye, transport. Guess we missed it again. Oh, bollocks. Oh, Noah always does this. How many times is it we've had to walk home now? Well, good thing the camp isn't that far. <laughs> right, gang? Hold on, there's a dead body here. Trips. And uh, I think this is a pretty good transitioning point to um, to Xenoblade. Or oh, sorry, uh, to, for the first part of this playthrough. But yeah. Uh, all right, let's head back to Colony Nine. I guess I'll catch you guys later. Uh, like subscribe, all that stuff, and uh, I'll stay right here, and you'll catch me exactly in this spot. I promise. So uh, see you guys later then.